यू नो गुड वे डेट आई हैव नॉलेज गिवर सुजीत कुमार दुबी जी एंड टूडे टॉपिक इज इंटेस्टनल ग्लैंड और जब भी हम इंटेस्टनल इंटेस्टनल ग्लैंड की बात करते हैं जैसे ही हम कहते हैं कि इंटेस्टनल तब दो इंटेस्टाइन की बात आता है फर्स्ट इज स्मॉल इंटेस्टाइन सेकेंड लार्ज इंटेस्टाइन तो इन दैट वेच इंटेस्टाइन वी विल स्टडी दस तो इन दैट इंटेस्टनल ग्लैंड वी विल स्टडी अबाउट द स्मॉल इंटेस्टाइन इन द स्मॉल इंटेस्टाइन विच ग्लैंड इज परजेंट जैसे कि हम जानते हैं कि पूरे हमारे एलिमेंट्री कैनाल में फोर लेयर होता है सिरोशा लेयर मस्कुलरिस म्यूकोशा एंड म्यूकोशा तो ये जो ब्रनर्स ग्लैंड विच इज प्रजेंट इन द स्मॉल इंटेस्टाइन ऑफ द शब म्यूकोशा लेयर वल्ली ओके सब म्यूकोशा में तो पाया जाता है बट इन सब म्यूकोशा ऑफ ड्यूडनम वल्ली दिस मीन्स की Brunner's gland is present in submucosa layer of only in duodenum. That is part of a small intestine. First part of a small intestine. And here also we are talking about the small intestine, intestinal gland. Okay. Two. Then. This is Brunner's gland is present in only duodenum part in submucosa layer. Okay. Second is Krebs of Leverkusen. Krebs of Leverkusen is present in mucosa layer in all parts of the small intestine. All part duodenum, jejunum and ileum. Not only in the duodenum, in all parts of the small intestine, crypts of liver can gland sharp project. Crypts, crypts with valley spans. Okay. After that, if we talk about the intestinal juice, intestinal juice that is also called succus intricus, that the pH is seven point six. And it smells the volume is two to three liter per day, and its composition is also present. Okay, from the starting we are seeing, try to understand in good way. This is the intestinal gland, and we are talking about the in a small intestine. In the small intestine gland, this means intestinal gland, two glands are present: Brunner's gland and Krebs of liver gland. Brunner's gland in the submucosa of duodenum only. Okay, this means the Brunner's gland is present in duodenum part of only, but in submucosa layer. And Krebs of Leverkusen, Krebs is valley. Krebs of Leverkusen in mucosa layer of all parts of small intestine. Brunner's gland is present only duodenum part of a small intestine, and Krebs of Leverkusen is present in all parts of a small intestine. After that, we talked about the intestinal juice that is also called succus and tricus. Its pH is seven point six, and intestinal juice volume is two to three liter per day. pH is seven point six, and volume is two to three liter per day. If we talk about the composition of intestinal juice, then that is water, water plus inorganic salt plus mucus plus enzyme. Water plus inorganic salt, that is watery part, and you can say inorganic part. This is 
formed by Brunner's gland. Okay, this is formed by Brunner's gland. And plus mucus plus enzyme, that is enzymatic part, and also called organic part. Enzyme is organic and water is inorganic. Water is inorganic, and enzyme is organic. So it is said that watery part, that is inorganic part, by Brunner's gland, and enzymatic part, mucus plus enzyme, that is. Enzymatic part or organic part by Krebs of Leverkusen. Okay, now this is the enzyme. This enzyme called brush bordered enzyme. And now we are see the completely of brush bordered enzyme. Okay. So now the matter of Enzymes called blood borders enzymes. Okay, now I have told you that intestinal those composition is water plus inorganic salt, mucus plus enzymes, water plus inorganic salt that is watery part and that is also called inorganic part because water is an inorganic substance. Okay, but it is secreted by Brunner's glands and mucus plus enzyme that is enzymatic part and also called organic part because enzyme is organic part and it is also secreted by Krebs of Leverkusen. You know good way that Krebs means belly and Leverkusen is the name of the scientist. Okay, the enzymes that is called brush border enzymes. Okay, so breast bordered enzymes thus dextrose, maltose, lactose, sucrose, sucrose, amino peptides, tripeptides, dipeptides, intestinal lipids, nucleotides, nucleosides. Okay, and this is the completely figures of a small intestine. And uh, you know, good way that in the small intestine, foliage is present. First is serosa layer, muscularis layer, submucosa layer, and mucosa layer. Okay, and now I have told you that Brunner's gland is present in the submucosa layer. Brunner's gland is present in the Brunner's gland is present in the Kishme in the submucosa of duodenum only. Okay, so Brunner's gland in duodenum part of submucosa. And Krebs of Leverkusen that is present in the mucosa layer in all small intestine. So this is the mucosa layer, and Krebs of Leverkusen is present in the mucosa layer. Okay, mucosa layer. And this is the brush bordered. This is the brush bordered cells, and this is microvilli. And I told you that this completely is Krebs of Leverkusen. Okay, and Krebs of Leverkusen is present in mucosa layer of all small intestine parts. In all parts of a small intestine, and this is present in the mucosa layer. Okay, and that is that is Brunner's gland 
ब्रनस ग्लैंड इज प्रजेंट इज शब म्यूकोशा लेयर ऑफ ड्यूडनम वनली तो इफ यू डोंट नो दे नो दैट दिस इज द ब्रनर्स ग्लैंड एंड ब्रनर्स ग्लैंड इज प्रजेंट इन द शब म्यूकोशा लेयर ऑफ ड्यूडनम पार्ट वनली तो दिस इज द शब म्यूकोशा लेयर एंड इन द शब म्यूकोशा ड्यू इन द शब म्यूकोशा ब्रनर्स ग्लैंड इज प्रजेंट and in the mucosa layer crypts of lubricant is present and okay and brunner's gland is also formed by glandular shell and glandular shell work is gland this means ki secretion glandular shell this means that work is of ओके तो दिस इज अ प्रूफ एंड दिस इज ग्लैंडुलर सेल्स ऑफ म्यूकोशा एंड ग्लैंडुलर सेल्स ऑफ म्यूकोशा ग्लैंडुलर से टुगेदर फॉर्म कॉल्ड क्रिप्स ऑफ लेबर कैन ओके ग्लैंडुलर से टुगेदर फॉर्म क्रिप्स ऑफ लेबर कैन दिस इज अ ग्लैंडुलर सेल and it's together called crypts of labor can crypts means valley valley and labor can is the name of the scientist okay so this is the proof and this is the epithelial mucosa is a mucosa by <laughs> simple columnar epithelium okay so this is the proof that Brunner's gland is present in the shab mucosa layer, and crypts of Leberkan is present in the mucosa layer. You can say with your naked eye that this is a completely proof of the Brunner's gland of crypts of Leberkan, where Brunner's gland is present, and where crypts of Leberkan present. This is a completely proof for you. Okay, you were saying that this is the Brunner's gland, that this is present in the sub mucosa layer, and this is the crypt of liver conduct, present in the mucosa layer. And this matter I have said in in few minutes ago, before. Okay, and this is the proof of that. Okay, in the next class we will study the how substrate we form products, which we eat. and how the how that will convert in the energy and how will made energy from that food about this complete we will study in the next classes that's all process if we take the substrate then how will form the product then product will form in the presence of enzymes but how completely about this you will know in the next class so to know about the process of digestion wait of next class okay thank you